Hi everyone, this is Joe from Big Tree Solutions, and today I'm going to show you two new features that we've added to running restaurant and invoice. So the first thing is multi-restaurant select, and the second is the ability to uh, export IIF files. So to get started with exporting IIF files, we're going to go to settings. Uh, we're going to scroll down. Uh, once you get to QuickBooks Setup, you're going to enter your bank account payment or your bank account that you're going to use to set up with QuickBooks. So in this case, I'm going to use Wells Fargo. And that's the name I have set up for my example. So we'll save. Now we're going to go ahead and go back to the main menu. So RDS Logic, Reports, Invoice. And then I'm going to show you multi-select to start off with. So in the past, you could only select all or one restaurant. Uh, now you have the opportunity to select all or you can select multiple restaurants which will be very helpful if you have many restaurants that are on different pay schedules. So if you have you know 10 restaurants that you have to pay all this week you'll be able to unselect the select box and then you can select those restaurants that you're looking to reconcile today. So now that we've selected these restaurants, we've got four restaurants here, and we're going to pick the month of October. It will generate the report. And now, instead of having all or one restaurant, there's the four that we've selected will be here. So now we've also added the feature to export IIF files to QuickBooks. And this is what QuickBooks uses to import data uh, for check writing and information. So you'll see here there are multiple places to do this. Down at the bottom here you have doing it for an individual and up in the right hand corner you can do it for all. So right here you'll be able to uh, do all but in this case I'm just going to do 43rd Street Deli uh, just for just to make this go quickly. So we'll download it. You'll see here it's going to be labeled BTS underscore underscore QuickBooks, and then underscore the days that we have selected. So now we're going to go to QuickBooks, go to File, Utilities, Import, IIF Files, click on that. We're going to go to the file on our computer and double click it. And now you'll see the data has been imported. So if I go to View Balances now, you're going to see, um, we're going to click Payables. Now the check that I just ran the report for is now here in QuickBooks. I can double click on it if I'd like, and that's gonna bring it up, and it's gonna actually show me the breakdown, um, payables, delivery fees, everything that needs to be included in this check. Um, now you can print, and you'll be able to send this right to the restaurant. So we hope that you enjoy these features. If you have any questions, please email us at support at bigtreesolutions.com. Thanks and have a great day.